for us it is significant because we have on our agenda uh, at least six or seven priority areas that we want to stress and that we want to see accomplished by the time we come out. It might, might not be that easy because what has happened in the past and we heard it in the speeches is that the country that has the, the pro tem chairmanship puts out its priorities and you try as much as possible because it's only six months. But we try to prioritize them and so you try to do the first ones uh, uh, as best possible. But those that are not accomplished by the time you come out in six months, then the next uh, country that takes up the chairmanship then proceeds with also their priorities but also completing what has been left from the, from the past what, presidency. What are some what of those priorities? <laughs> well, for us, important is that uh, integration uh, between CARICOM and SICA. Um, Last year there was a CARICOM SICA meeting and at that meeting um, it was informed that uh, we have to strengthen that, that, that partnership. There is so much politically but also economically that we can benefit from and so we have to strengthen that partnership. But also because of our quest uh, within the biodiversity and climate change uh, arena that we have to work together because we are small island states uh, in the Caribbean and the small countries in Central America which are all small developing countries and so we have some of the same effects from climate change we have some of the same needs and really the people uh, can integrate and and come together with sharing of those experiences that like, like I mentioned uh, sharing expertise uh, no need for us to be uh, duplicating efforts if we already have something that has worked in one country and we can uh, sort of copy and, and, and do what that, what we can in, in our country but we believe that um, also, the issues of um, moving forward with uh, the Climate Change Fund that was established recently at uh, COP27 with uh, loss and damage, I think that if we can work together, we can push for that. Um, from CARICOM side, where we know we are always hear the, the, the comments and from the leadership from Barbados and the other countries in the Caribbean, from us in Belize, we make, make certain that we express those same sentiments at, uh, at our national addresses. And so we want to see how we can put all those issues and try moving those forward. Um, also, we, we are looking that uh, we have projects within Central America and the Caribbean which are sponsored by some of the same partners in development. We have the UK which is assisting us with the uh, Biodiverse Landscape Fund, which is a regional project. We have the projects for the uh, Five Great Forests of Mesoamerica, which is also a landscape project that not only looks at the conservation or preservation of the forest at the landscape level, but looks specifically at communities that are affected so that you can provide those livelihoods. Again, coming back to the Ministry's uh, first name of sustainable development, which means that you have to look at the social side, the environmental side, but also look at the, at the um, economic side of things.